I've been hearing about burglars that have been hacking wireless doorbells and cameras that are connected over Wi-Fi. They're using this device, which is only about $15 worth of parts and it's being sold everywhere. Now this isn't a hacking device, it's just a microcontroller that you can use for many legitimate projects. But the instructions to build this deauth tool are out there and it's pretty easy to do for me at least. So once I built this, I wanted to test it against my Ring Video Doorbell 2. I ran it in less than a minute and knocked it offline. Now what can you do to prevent this? Unfortunately, the Ring Video Doorbell 2 does not support 802.11w, which is protected management frames. If it did support that, then this attack would not be useful. Another option would be WPA3, which the Ring Video Doorbell 2 does not support. So if you have a Ring Video Doorbell 2 and you're worried about these kinds of attacks for burglars in your area, then the only thing you can do is to upgrade. The good thing is there's at least two low cost options. So the Ring Video Doorbell Plus, which is the old Ring Video Doorbell Pro, and the new Ring Video Doorbell Pro 2, both support dual band Wi-Fi. Now these devices only support 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi. So if you have a dual band device, it's not gonna be able to affect it. It's just gonna shift to the other band. And I haven't been able to confirm it, but these newer devices should also support WPA3 and protected management frames. Unfortunately, a lot of these older devices are using just 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi because it's cheaper to implement. So a lot of the Wi-Fi security cameras are gonna be hackable in the same way. So if this is happening in your area, I'll put a link below for the new Ring Video Doorbell Plus and the Ring Video Doorbell Pro. And that's there you go. Remember to like and subscribe for more videos on Wi-Fi and tech products.